Have you ever decided to take a cruise only to get overwhelmed by all the cabin and dining options? I am here to take some of that stress away. After spending hours diving into reviews and research, I've put together my top pick for the best cabin and dining options on the Sun Princess. Stick around, because I'll help you make the best choice for a fantastic cruise experience. Whether you're looking for the perfect room or the tastiest food, I've got you covered on what to choose and why I think it's the best. Before we dive into my top picks, please like and subscribe. If you have your own top picks, leave those in the comments below. And if you're like me, super excited on the day of your cruise, but stuck waiting at the airport or to board the ship, check out the links below. I have a few recommendations to help pass the time while you wait. The first time my partner and I decided to book a cruise on the Sun Princes, we wanted it to be a unique and romantic getaway, so we spent a lot of time deciding on the perfect stateroom. After doing tons of research, we decided on a balcony cabin, which turned out to be an amazing choice for us as a couple. When we first walked into our balcony cabin, we were greeted by the beautiful natural light flooding in from the large glass doors. The whole room felt bright and welcoming, making it much more comfortable. The best part was stepping out onto our private balcony. It was incredible to have our own outdoor space to enjoy the fresh sea air and the stunning views. Every morning, we'd sit out there with our coffee, watching the sun rise over the ocean, and in the evenings, we'd sip wine as the sun set, painting the sky in vibrant colors. It was so peaceful and romantic, just the two of us sharing those special moments. Having a balcony really enhanced our whole cruise experience, it made us feel so connected to the ocean, listening to the soothing sound of the waves and gazing out at the endless horizon. It added a sense of tranquility that you don't get in an inside cabin. The extra space was a big plus too. Our cabin felt more spacious and versatile, allowing us to relax inside and outside. One of our favorite things was having dinner on our balcony. We'd order room service and enjoy our meal outside with the ocean as our backdrop. Sometimes, we'd lie on the loungers, stargazing and talking for hours. It felt like our own little slice of paradise. Those moments were so intimate and unique, making our trip truly unforgettable. I recommend choosing a balcony cabin if you're planning a romantic cruise on the Sun Princess. It offers the perfect blend of privacy and luxury, with plenty of natural light and space to make your stay more enjoyable. For the best experience, Aim for a cabin midship on a higher deck. This location gives you the best views and a stable ride, plus it's convenient for accessing all the ship's amenities. If you prefer a more secluded experience, an aft cabin on a higher deck offers fantastic views and a bit more privacy. A balcony cabin on the Sun Princess is the perfect choice for couples looking to make the most of their cruise vacation. The private outdoor space, romantic moments, and overall enhanced experience will make your trip truly special and memorable. All right, foodies, it's time to talk about one of the most exciting parts of any cruise dining options. On the Sun Princess, there are so many incredible places to eat that it's hard to pick a favorite. Whether you're in the mood for a formal sit-down dinner, a casual bite, or something in between, this ship has got you covered. Get ready to explore a world of flavors and discover where to have the best dining experiences at sea. Stick around because I will share my top picks and explain why each is a must try. When my partner and I first boarded the Sun Princess, we were so excited to explore all the dining options on the ship. There were many choices and each one sounded better than the last. We couldn't wait to try them all and see which would become our favorites. On the first night, we decided to dress up and head to the Horizons dining room. It was so elegant, with its two-story windows that wrapped around the back of the ship. The views were breathtaking, especially as the sun set. The menu was diverse, offering international cuisine and classic dishes. We felt like we were dining in a fancy restaurant on land, and the experience was unforgettable. Another night, we craved some Italian food, so we made a reservation at Sabatini's. Even though it didn't have windows, the backlit panels showing the Italian countryside made it feel so cozy and intimate. We indulged in delicious pasta, seafood, and meat dishes. It was like a little piece of Italy right there on the ship. 
One of the highlights of our trip was dining at the Crown Grill. This steakhouse offered a premium dining experience with high quality steaks and seafood. The atmosphere was luxurious and the service was top notch. It was the perfect place to celebrate a special occasion and we loved every bite. For a more casual meal, we often visited the Americana Diner. It was a great spot for quick and satisfying meals without the formality of other venues. Whether we wanted breakfast, lunch, or dinner, the classic American fare always hit the spot. The flexible and relaxed atmosphere made it a convenient choice when we just wanted to grab a bite and go. The Eatery Buffet was another favorite. It is located on Deck 9 and offers a wide variety of international dishes and comfort foods. We enjoyed the relaxed dining experience and the vast selection of dishes. It was perfect for those days when we wanted to sample a little of everything. We also tried the Asian-inspired specialty restaurants, Uma Teppanyaki and Uma Hot Pot. The teppanyaki featured interactive Japanese-style grilling, which was so much fun to watch and even more fun to eat. The Hot Pot offered a communal dining experience with simmering pots of broth and fresh ingredients. Both provided unique and engaging dining experiences, perfect for couples and groups looking for something different. Finally, we couldn't resist dining at Catch by Rudy, a seafood-focused restaurant by the acclaimed chef, Rudy Sodeman. The fresh and innovative seafood dishes stood out, and the creative, high-quality offerings made it a must-visit for seafood lovers like us. Overall, the Sun Princess offers various dining options, catering to different tastes and preferences. For a formal dining experience with stunning views, the Horizons Dining Room is a top choice. If you prefer specialty dining, Sabatini's and the Crown Grill offer excellent Italian and steakhouse options. The Americana Diner and the Eatery Buffet provide flexibility and variety for a more casual setting. For unique and interactive dining experiences, Uma Teppanyaki, Uma Hot Pot, and Catch by Rudy are excellent choices. No matter what you're in the mood for, the Sun Princess has something to satisfy your cravings. Each dining venue offers its unique atmosphere and menu, making your cruise culinary adventure unforgettable. After hours of research and first-hand experience, I can say that a balcony cabin is ideal. The private outdoor space, romantic ambience, and enhanced experience are unmatched. So when you're ready to sail with your special someone, the Sun Princess has the perfect cabin and dining options to make your cruise memorable. Ready to set sail on another delicious and luxurious journey? Click the video above and let's travel.